lot of people would think is Connor. I think I, honestly, I think Connor would probably be one of the easiest fights. You know, people people don't. You know, I guess everybody buys okay, into the hype, the especially bait. the casual fans. They buy into that hype so bad. Uh, when you look at a skill for skill, I think if you if you ask Connor like how to you know break down some of these techniques, I don't think he would have a damn clue what he's talking about. Uh, especially when you talk about on the ground, you know. And, and there's no way that that man keep his hand, you know, not let me get my hands on him. So. Uh, yeah. he, he actually would be one of the easiest fights, you know, to build up and yeah. anything along with it. It will make it tough, but the actual fight itself, I think, won't be too hard. Uh, the hardest fight right now, if you're asking me, uh, the hardest fight to me is always guys that, that I don't give it, that I always think sucks. So uh, maybe it might be Nate Diaz. You never know. I think Nate Diaz is trash. Yeah. So maybe he might give me the, the, the worst fight because I'll go in there overconfident. You never know. So I, I, I try and stay true to myself. I try and stay honest with myself. And if I'm being honest, it's always the guys that I think stuff the worst that always do the best against me. Uh, and that huh. might just be somebody like me. Okay, on the beat. Um, I haven't heard too much. Um, I don't know. You got one, two, and three. Um, I'm ranked number one, and obviously I would have taken the rematch right away. He was asking. He was like, hey, I want to give – he was saying before the fight, I want to give Dom an immediate rematch. Right. And we, we were in line to do so, but the reason I said no is because I've already had the belt before, and I've been hurt, and I've held up the division before with my injuries. I knew my feet had to heal. I, I knew I needed a good maybe six months of time to just let my feet rest because I beat the crap out of him with those three title fights uh, coming back off of knee surgeries. So my plantar fascia tendonitis was just real bad, so I needed to give it time, and I knew, you know what? I figured a 25-year-old newly crowned champion was just going to get on the bike and start defending the title and try to build his legacy. Right. I didn't know that he was going to get some injections in his back and that he's hurt. I didn't know that. Um, and... This isn't me playing down his injury. Anytime you have a back injury, it's misery. And he's a tough dude, so no question, he's probably seriously hurt. But, I mean, he didn't get cut by the knife. There, there's nothing that's been done there. So there's really no, I mean, what's really going on? And I, I look at it and I think, well, I'd love to fight for that belt. TJ's next. I would have taken that rematch right away, right. immediately. And I'd probably be in line right now instead of TJ if I would have just said yes knowing that Cody was going to need a year off. I would have been like, yes, absolutely. I'll take a year off with you, Cody. Okay. You know? And, and I'll, <laughs> yeah. rest, I'll rest my body with you, champ. You know? So you know what? I'm doing that now. Um, yeah. why, would, why would I fight with more... I, I defended the title more than anybody in this division in the history of the division. Um, I, I held it longer than anybody in the history of the division. And... Um, I'm, old, you know, I'm a little bit older. I'm 32 now, so I'm, I'm choosing my fights wisely. My, my, in the sense of, I want to fight the best in the world. I want to fight up the division because I deserve to because I've fought the best in the world since oh, the beginning, and um, that's who I'm looking to fight. So fighting backwards down the division just doesn't make sense to me. Uh, I just hope that if Cody can't make it to this fight, you know, maybe they'll let me and TJ fight for the interim title. The only reason to do an interim title isn't to take away juice from the champ, Cody. It's not to do that. It's to build, keep the division moving, keep the division uh, at a high standard while he's just hurt. He'll still be the technical champion of the division. He just will have to fight the, the interim title holder when he comes back, and I think it makes the title fight of more importance. So I don't see an issue with the interim belt Personally, if he can't come back and defend the title within the, the entire uh, calendar year, that would make sense right. to me. But I'm not the UFC. They have their plans. They're going to do what they want with Cody. We don't know how bad his injury is or isn't. And uh, honestly, I just hope the best that, that he gets healthy. Okay, on the beat. First of all, he's 120 pounds. Second of all, he's a southpaw. Right. Thank you. Sort of all, I'm more of a, I'm more a ring on that man myself. I feel. Where was the mention of, of, of that fight? That's the fight you need to make. You can't fight these men. He didn't even seem interested in the last one. I don't think. I think he needs to challenge himself more. But he's pretty skilled. But he's not applicable for this camp. Yeah, no, I'm a fan of his. I'm a fan of his. 